I am awed by the legacy of Lauren Rakin, who was one of the founding faculty members of Gallatin. He was part of a very small group of people who had an unbelievable vision for the future of liberal arts education, and it's a vision that remains prescient and necessary and urgent today. The first full-fledged faculty member of the Gallatin Division then turned school in 1995. We owe him everything. If it weren't for Lauren, um, we wouldn't be known for our arts program and the artist-scholar model of learning. When an artist creates, what does that mean for the individual and the society in which they operate? Lauren's legacy is about uh, the individual and their place in society and how the arts are a river and a path toward the benefit of both. He had an expansive imagination, a generous and feeling heart, and he felt that way about everyone that he met. It would not light up the conversation. I think it would fire up a conversation. He would stay quiet for, sometimes for a long time, and then within a few seconds, you'd see the whole room on fire. And that's Lauren to me. Lauren is the cornerstone of all that is Gallatin to me. He's the reason I'm here. He was a great professor for me. He was a great colleague and a great friend. I'm so appreciative of his contribution to education, to school, and to all our lives here. If Gallatin, School for Individualized Study, were Mount Olympus, Lauren Reagan would be Zeus. And all of us, would be his children. He embodied everything that Gallatin stands for in every way. And he was supportive and kind and loving and just, just one of the best human beings I have ever known. So every day that we are part of the institution that is NYU Gallatin 50 years later, we are living the legacy of Lauren Rakin and we are abundantly grateful to him for that gift. How much do we love you? We tell you no lie. How deep is the ocean? How high is the Let's raise a glass to Lauren Rakin.